All right, so today we are once again relying on the power of family to take down the new Siblings Bond Super Bad Road stage on Global. Now, as you guys can tell, my voice is still a little bit off, but I am feeling much, much better. So thank you to everyone who expressed their concerns over the past couple of days. I'll be fine. I'm not dying. It's just gonna take a while before I'm uh, fully back to normal. Okay, so anyways, with that said, let's take a look at the team we'll be running today. We got the double LR Cobros because they are the best leaders for the Siblings Bond category. We also have AGL Tapion, the LR Tapion Eminosha, the Tech Androids, the uh, AGL LR Androids, and finally the STR High School Gohan. The items are the same as always. And uh, yeah, let's jump in here and see how things go. Now, as far as rotations go, we basically have the perfect rotations. That is amazing. We got both androids in the first rotation, and we got both the Tapions in the second rotation. Wow, okay, so perfect start. And uh, I think I will be using the active skill immediately. Let me just turn the animations on because they look awesome. Um, let's skip the attacks for... Well, who has the most attacks is the question. I think we have three from Goku. Uh, it looks like two from Krillin and three from Roshi as well. So I think I'm going to skip the Roshi attacks. Yeah, let's do that. So uh, we'll target Roshi. We'll pop the active skill. And then uh, we should be able to cancel out his attacks so we don't have to worry about them. Because um, the attack at the end, right, against the Gobros, I'm a little bit concerned about because they take some time to build up. So if there's no attacks there, then this rotation will be just fine. So uh, let's also pop an Icarus to be safe. And we'll put the tech androids in the first slot. We'll go for... Uh, I guess it doesn't really matter. Let's go for Roshi. Let's go for Roshi. That's going to be nine orbs. And then we can get a 18k super. For the LR androids, and uh, hopefully we can finish off Roshi with the Gobros. Some nice tanking there, 5.3 mil attack to start. <sighs> okay, here we go. Okay, we sealed him. Oh, you know what? Maybe I didn't need to. Uh, cancel out the Roshi attacks because I'm not gonna lie I kind of forgot <laughs> that the tech androids seal right that just completely slipped my mind so um either way it wouldn't have been a super at the end so the Gobros would have been fine that nah, doesn't matter it doesn't really matter but yeah um it wasn't really necessary to actually use that active skill on the Roshi okay either way we're doing well um Killed Roshi, Goku's half dead, and I'm guessing that we'll probably be able to finish this off actually in this second rotation. Okay, so I'm going to, I guess either Tapion is good here. Let's put the LR Tapion in the first slot. No, actually let's put AGL Tapion so that I can get an 18 key super for the Tapion in Minosha. There we go. And yeah, I think we'll be able to finish off this fight in the second rotation. This should be a relatively quick run here. Although we could run into some problems in the last fight, because that's usually harder. But uh, things are going really well. Things are going really well. These two rotations with the Tapions and the Androids are very, very strong. Both uh, damage-wise and also defensively. So... I'm very confident in this team's ability to clear the stage with no issues. Okay, so Krillin's gonna take one more uh, turn here, which is fine. Okay, so who should we... I mean, I'm a little bit concerned about potentially a super here. And we don't have that many tech orbs, so the tech androids actually aren't gonna get that much defense. Like, if I give them these... That's going to be, what, like 150k, my bad, 180k, 180k, still not a ton, 
but actually I think Krillin's super attack is a key blast super attack, so we should actually absorb it, right? If uh, they, he does super us. Yeah, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. There you go. I love that, man. I love that. There's so many enemies in the game have key blast super attacks. So like, I don't know what the percentage is, but like it feels like at least half of the supers that we're supposed to take, we just take no damage because they just absorb it, which is amazing. Okay, well, there you go. That is the first fight. No issues there. Let's move on to fight number two, which is... Um, we got Shen and... Oh, it's Crane School. Okay, we got Crane School going here. All right, so... I'm going to... Hmm... Yeah, either Tapion's fine, but I'm trying to see the types here. So there's no tech type. Um, and there's also... Well, there's an AGL type um, in the Chiaotzu. So I guess we should leave the AGL Tapion in that first slot. And I'm going to go for Tien with the AGL Tapion. And let's, uh, let's keep going for Tien. Let's just try to take out like one enemy at a time here. Um, unfortunately, no 18k super there, but not a big deal. And then we'll go for Xiao Tzu. Uh, should I pop an item? I don't think we need an item here, honestly. You know what? Let's see what happens with no items. I think these guys are all more than tanky enough to hold their own, even without any additional damage reduction. The normal was fine, at least. Yep, okay, double digits so far. Let's see how the uh, LR Tapion Minosha hold up here. Oh my god. So thankfully... Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, so... Um, I might have gotten a little bit overconfident. I might have gotten a little bit overconfident there. Uh, luckily, we're going to kill the, the Chiaotzu, so we don't have to worry about a super there. But man, um, that could have been really bad. That could have been really, really bad. I'm glad that it wasn't Chiaotzu that supered the LR, because if that was the case, we would have died with um, you know, the type disadvantage, right? So luckily, that didn't happen. But wow, that was, that was dangerous. Okay, so we're going to pop a Princess Snake there. <laughs> And we'll be fine here, but definitely like some kind of damage reduction item is still recommended. As you guys can see there, I got lucky. I, I definitely got lucky. If I had taken a type disadvantage super, um, there was no chance I would have survived that turn. Okay, so Tien's dead. We're taking a super here, which is not actually going to do any damage because we absorbed that. So the android is just putting in work, man. Just putting in work all day. I love it. And uh, this should be good enough, I think. Or, oh, no, no, we have type disadvantage. Okay, never mind. Wait, hold on. Was it the LR androids or the... Oh, it was the LR androids. I'm, I'm surprised they didn't, take, they didn't do more damage there, actually. Eh, doesn't matter. All right. Um, I think we'll be good to not item this turn now. But I'm still, like, kind of worried after what we took last turn. So, uh, just to be safe, I'm going to pop an Aider. Because I'm not about to die at this point in the run, you know? So, yeah, let's finish him off. Let's move on. And we're going to be a little bit more cautious going forward. Because, yeah, that was pretty rough, man. We would have we survived that super, no problem. <laughs> But if it was, like, the LR that took a super, I'm still not really sure how well they would actually, you know, hold hold up. Okay, so last fight, we see a Piccolo. Is it just Piccolo or somebody else? Oh, Piccolo and Gohan. Father-son combo. Family. Family. Okay, so... <laughs> um, same thing, uh, double androids. Uh, let me see... Actually, maybe I should put the LR and No, but they don't get any defense before they super. That's the problem. So they have to be a slot 2 unit. And we're going to go for Gohan, obviously. 
Um, I guess this would be the best bet. Okay. And 231k defense. Not bad. But obviously, Icarus first. Gotta do it. And, uh... Wait, did I target Piccolo or did I target Gohan? I swear I targeted Gohan with the tech androids. At least I should have. Well, anyways, um, I guess we'll go for Gohan again with the LR. And we should actually kill Gohan with all three attacks. <laughs> okay, let me see who we're attacking here. It should be Gohan. I wanted to. There we go. Okay, we did target Gohan. I got confused for a second because we went back to targeting Piccolo. Uh, right after, but no, Gohan is definitely dead. This should actually kill him, and then we can do some damage to Piccolo as well with the uh, Gobros. And we're gonna make quick work of this fight. Oh, yeah, she survived. Okay, additional super. This will be enough. It's gotta be enough to kill Gohan. There he goes, and then Piccolo with the super. Ooh, that was. That was some damage. That was actually some damage. All right. Yo, go, go, not Gohan. Uh, Piccolo is no joke, man. <laughs> Piccolo is no joke. That's that's pretty crazy. Oh wow, and the normals too. That normal just did 58k. We popped an Icarus, right? I'm pretty sure I used Icarus. Why are we still taking so much damage? It's always weird to me, like sometimes Super Battle Road, it feels like it's super easy and then some other times it's like surprising how much damage some of these guys take. Um, I don't know. I, I guess with the GoBros it's because they haven't had a chance to build up yet, so their defense is still mediocre. But um, the LR androids with double supers, I thought they would have been fine to take a super attack with an Icarus active, but no man, apparently... Apparently not. Um, yeah, that was pretty wild. That was pretty wild. Another super here, which obviously we're not going to take damage from, but it still always makes me nervous when I say, whenever I see the super attack animation. But nah, guys, we'll be fine. I think uh, these triple, or actually we only get two supers from Harutagarn, but these two Harutagarn supers should be at least close to killing him and then the next rotation will definitely get Piccolo out of here and that's gonna be the run a little bit longer it did take a little bit longer than I was expecting but still it wasn't too bad it wasn't too bad if it wasn't for that one turn where I was like being kind of dumb and uh, trying to test you know my units a bit um, we wouldn't really have come that close to dying ever but yeah, there was that one turn, I'll admit, there was that one, you know, moment where uh, I got a little bit overconfident about my team, and that almost risked the run, but otherwise, man, oh my god, what am I, <laughs> what was that? <laughs> that was disgusting. Um, but yeah, man, once again, the, the power of family is undefeated, you know, family prevails, as always. Um... We're always, you know, every time, making Dom Chiretto proud. Uh, the power of family is uh, not to be underestimated. Is not to be... Uh, what's the word? I even know. I'm just saying things now. That's going to do it, guys. <laughs> maybe, maybe I'm still sick. I think, I think my brain is still uh, a little bit compromised. So, uh, we're going to call it there before I say anything stupid before I make myself look more dumb and <laughs> that is the run guys new siblings bond super battered stage defeated with family and uh that's all there is to say man that's all there is to say thank you guys so much for watching let me know in the comments down below how you're doing with this new stage if you're having any having any issues with it or it was it you know fairly simple like some of the last you know some of the previous ones uh, when it comes to Super Bad Road, right, like, I think, generally speaking, if you're able to beat, like, actually, that's not true. I was going to say, if you can beat one stage, you can beat most of them, but not everyone has access to, like, all the different categories, so I take that back. Either way, it wasn't too bad. 
wasn't too bad. So, uh, yeah, that's it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. As always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. Sub to the channel if you're new. Hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Bria. Signing out.